This is the day, this is the day that the Lord has made, that the Lord has made. I, I will rejoice, I will rejoice and be glad in it, and be glad in it. This is the day that the Lord has made, I will rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day, this is the day that the Lord has made. Father, <clears throat> we just come before your holy throne. We ask that you forgive us of our sins we have committed against you and against those made in your image. Father, I ask right now, according to your word in Psalm 34, verse 7, that you can your angels around all of us participating of this broadcast around our loved ones, family members, ministry partners, in-laws, ex, in-laws, and friends, to protect us and keep us safe from any form of retaliation or attacks of the devil in his demons. And we declare Isaiah 54, 17, no weapon formed against us shall prosper. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Excuse me. Welcome everyone to another live edition of our Spiritual Warfare Strategic Network, The Miracle Hour, and Spiritual Surgery. Amen. Praise God. Everybody's going to get healthy here. Praise God. Hallelujah. I said healthy. Amen. There's no sickness in heaven. How about that? There's no cancer in heaven. Why should you have cancer? Why should you have cancer here when there's no cancer in heaven? Amen. Our mission is to make everybody healthy. Praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. That's why now we have our spiritual surgery. Amen. I'll explain a little bit more when it comes to the time to do our spiritual surgery. Amen. This is our ministry, Spiritual Warfare Strategic Network. So this is a membership network. Why membership? Because people, okay, let me tell you, people are not easy to commit to anything, okay? People don't like to commit to anything. That's why they are all sick and diseased, okay, and messed up. They do not commit to anything. They don't commit to God. They don't commit to Jesus. They only commit to Netflix. Okay? They are very good committing to Netflix. I'm telling you. Okay? Okay, so here, okay, in order for you to benefit from what we do, you and your family, not just you, but your family as well, you must become a member of our Spiritual Warfare Strategic Network. What is it? Well, listen. We put devils to run every day. I said every day. We put demons to run every day. If we don't put them to run, well, guess what? They're going to come and they're going to destroy us. Because they are on a mission to destroy human beings. They come to steal, kill, and destroy. Okay? Now, if you don't do what Jesus told you to do, then demons are going to jump on you. They're going to beat you up and beat you down and knock you out and knock you dead. All right. That's what they do all over the planet. Turn on the news. Turn on the news. That's what they're doing. Turn on the news. Okay. When you turn on the news you're gonna, and you start reading everything there or, or watching on, on TV or whatever, then you're going to see. Then you're going to find out what demons are all about. They are, beating, they are beating people up left and right, right and left, everywhere, everywhere on the planet, okay? Including your neighborhood, right next to your house, all right? That's what I'm talking about, amen? That's why we have our spiritual warfare strategic network in place, okay? I have, I have children. I have grandchildren, amen? I have family members. Amen. I got to stand in the gap for my family members. And I love to do it. And I know what to do it. That's why I put Dimas to run. 
I put the must run on my behalf, on behalf of my descendants, on behalf of my entire family members, and then on behalf of my entire household. I do it every day. Now, because we have members here, I also do it for themselves. I also knock devils out on behalf of our members, on behalf of their family members, on behalf of the entire household. You can do it too, but you know, the fact that I am doing it, it's more power to you, more people doing it. Now, what I do, who else is doing out there? Who else is doing this out there? Who else is putting your demons to run every day, several times a day? Who else? It doesn't exist. Okay? It doesn't exist. Nobody is doing this. <coughs> Come out, devil. Come out, devil. Okay? Nobody's doing this, folks. I am because I am called to do this. I'm on a mission. I have been on a mission for 35 years. Okay? And I and the only re, and the only day that I'm going to stop doing what God has called me to do, it's going to be the day that I'm going to depart from this planet to heaven. But in between now and then, I'll be knocking devils out every day. How about that? On behalf of people like yourself. You don't even know how to do it. That's why you get beat up by Satan left and right, right and left. You need Brother Carlos, okay, on your side. You need Brother Carlos in your corner. Amen. I'm called to do this. Okay. I'm called to do this. All right, now that you know, amen, that you have to sign up if you're not a member, become one. Where? BrotherCarlos.com. And if I were you, I will not go to bed tonight before you sign up. I will not do that. Because Satan, okay, I'm telling you, you don't, have, you don't need me to tell you this, okay, but Satan got one of his eye on you. Okay, he got an eye on you. Okay, he's just waiting for you to drop the ball. Amen. So they can jump, so he can jump on your back. I'm telling you, I, if I were you, I would not go to bed tonight. Okay, before signing up. Where can you sign up? BrotherCarlos.com. When you sign up, you are included, your family, amen, and your household. And then Brother Carlos is going to put your devils to run every day. Our ministry here, our spiritual warfare strategies not to work. We will put your, your demons to run every day. Amen. Several times a day. And live once a day. We are live right now. Right now it's 9.08 p.m. in California. It's 12.08 p.m. a.m. 12.08 a.m. in the East Coast. Amen. Hallelujah. On what? Uh, June 11th, 2024. June 11th. We are live right now. But you know, this broadcast is also being recorded and it's going to be, you know, available 24-7. Some people are going to watch it after we are done with the broadcast live. Some people will watch. That's okay. It works the same way. Now, now that you know that you must sign up in order to benefit from what we do. So what is that that we do? Well, we, we have our The Miracle Hour broadcast where we believe God for miracles. And by the way, since we started this, I have already received miracles. Some of you have already received miracles. Okay. Since we started this about a month ago or close to a month ago. Close to a month. Amen. I, I mean, I've been, I, I've done this several times in the past, but you know, for this particular broadcast, we we started about, just about a month ago, okay. And people have already reported, you know, uh, breakthroughs, including myself. Amen. One of them is a TV show that I'm going to do next week. I consider that a miracle. Why? Well, it's a TV show, right? more exposure for me they're gonna pay me right well it's a miracle amen praise god the last tv show i've done was in 2018 there was a uh 
Discovery Channel was the last one Discovery yeah Discovery Channel was the last one 2018 I did two in 2018 one was uh, BuzzFeed I did two for them and then later in the year I did one for BuzzFeed uh, for uh, Discovery Channel and that was it and then from that moment you know to this point I had done nothing but you know I got a call I got an invitation now I'm gonna do one amen next week on uh june 18th tuesday tuesday june 18th i may have to stay there also for the wednesday we'll see you know it's a miracle why because we have the miracle hour don't we if i were you i would become a member of this ministry okay we are up to something here and something big you get ready okay you're gonna prosper you're gonna be healed okay blessings will be coming your way but become a member because you are a member of netflix they only put demons in you they don't do you any good all they do is put devils in you every day and you are happy there aren't you that's what i'm talking about you know now, if you can become a member of a satan satanic network, why can't you become a member here? Right? Netflix belongs to Satan. Amen? That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Well, you're going to benefit from what? From the miracle hour. And then you're going to benefit also from our spiritual surgery. What is this? This is a spiritual surgery to make you healthy. To put that cancer to run away from you. To put that diabetes to take a hike. To put that heart condition to disappear from your body. And pain and arthritis and migraine headache. That's what I'm talking about. We are up to something, aren't we? We are up to something, aren't we? Are you going to become a member? We are getting members from all over. Today, we got a member from Germany. Congratulations, lady. I'm pretty sure you are here watching us right now. Germany, welcome. Amen. Praise God. We have members from Canada, from Germany, from UK, from Australia, from the US. Okay. Yeah, we are growing. We are growing. The more people, the better. The more power. So, okay, don't go anywhere. When we come to the point to do our spiritual surgery, I'm going to explain details how it works. Let's start right now with the miracle hour. Praise God. Hallelujah. Now, before we start here, before we ask God for miracles, I want you to repeat after me. Say, Father in heaven, I choose to forgive everyone that ever hurt me one way or another i forgive them i love them i bless them and i pray for them now father in heaven forgive me of all my trespasses and sins as i have forgiven those who have trespassed against me say amen now you are ready to to receive your miracle why because you forgave people god wants you to to forgive everybody under the sun that have hurt you okay amen so now you're ready to receive your miracle so let's go ahead and believe god for your miracles and for my miracles as well praise god Father, here we are before your holy throne, believing you for miracles, Father. Father, thank you. You know the areas in our lives that we are in need of, a, of miracles. Father, we ask you that you stretch your hands out towards all of us, our members, their family members, the entire household, myself, my descendants, my family members, my entire household, my ministry partners, their family members their entire household thank you father for bestowing miracles upon our lives thank you for performing miracles in our lives 
We know, Father, that you are at work even now. And that you are opening the windows of heaven and pouring out much blessings upon us here and upon our family members, upon our descendants, upon our entire household. In Jesus' mighty name, we praise you, Father. We lift your name on high. We declare that you are the King of kings and Lord of lords, creator of heaven and earth. And you are sitting on the throne of glory, majesty, power, dominion, salvation, redemption, anointing, forgiveness, and love. And you love us. We magnify you. We praise you. And we lift your name on high and we say, thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now say amen. Now we are going to put Dimas to run. That's our main goal here for our spiritual warfare strategies network is to put devils to run. When we put devils to run, we feel better, we feel happier, okay? Things prosper more better in our lives. We don't get as sick, amen? That's why it is a good idea to put Dimas to run. That's why I put Dimas to run on behalf of myself, on behalf of my descendants, on behalf of my family, on behalf of my, our, our members here on behalf of their family members, on behalf of their entire household, and we do it every day. I said every day. I said every day. I didn't say every other day. I didn't say once a week. I didn't say once a month. I said every day, several times a day, every day. That's why I know that nobody on the planet is doing this, other than Brother Carlos and his network here. We are. Putting devils to run several times a day, every day. Live once a day. And offline several times a day. Amen. Praise God. If your demon is in North Korea right now, I speak here and that demon can hear me loud and clear. Amen. If your demon is in Texas with you there, or, 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 or Minnesota, or, or Florida, I don't have to be on the phone. I don't have to be on, on, on the Skype. I don't have to be on Zoom. I say, Dima, come out. And that Dima hear me loud and clear. And the Dima come out. That's the way it is. Now we're going to put Dima to run. On behalf of our family. On behalf of ourselves. Praise God. <clears throat> the Bible says in the book of Luke chapter 10 verse 19. I have given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome. All the power of the enemy and nothing will harm you. Come out, evil spirits. Come out, devils. Come out, evil spirits. Come out, devils. Get out now. Get out now. Get out of our spiritual warfare strategic network members. Get out of their family members. Get out of the entire household. Get out of me. Get out of my descendants. Get out of my family. Get out of my entire household. Get out of my ministry partners. Get out of their family members. Get out of the entire household. Come out now. Come out, infirmity spirits. Go to the pit. Sickness and disease, come out now. Come out now. Insanity, mental illness, depression, schizophrenia. Come out now, fear. Come out now, panic attacks. Go now to the pit. Come out now. In Jesus' mighty name. Premature death, come out now. Go to the pit. Get out of us. Get out of us, in Jesus' mighty name. Get out of us, in Jesus' mighty name. Go now to the pit. Sexual immorality, pornography, go now to the pit. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Go now to the pit now. Go now to the pit now. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Take your nasty, dirty hands off all of us here. Off our family members, off our descendants, off our entire household, and go straight to the abyss now in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Come out now, murder spirit, premature death, murder, automobile accidents. Go now to the pit, insomnia, nightmares. Get out now. Go now to the pit. I command all demons to go now. Get out. All those that I have mentioned and those that I did not mention, all of you now, 
take a hike, disappear from our lives, and go straight to the abyss. In Jesus' mighty name, say amen. Take a deep breath three times right now. Come out, evil spirits. Come out, devils. Come out, witchcraft. On behalf of all of us here and our family members, I now break all witchcraft, voodoo, black magic, hexes, vexes, word, curse, and evil, I envy, jealousy, macumba, in Jesus' name, go now to the pit. In Jesus' mighty name, say amen. Hallelujah. Say hallelujah. Say thank you, Jesus. All right, now, as I told you yesterday, we are now, okay, ministering spiritual surgery. Let me explain a little bit here for the new people, okay? What is spiritual surgery? It's a biblical ministry. It's the ministry of healing, okay? Deliverance and healing, amen? Miracles, praise God. What is that that we do? Well, we put cancer to run. We put diabetes to run. Amen. We put uh, 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 arthritis to run. That's what we do here. That's why we call it spiritual surgery because it's done in the power of the Holy Spirit. It's not done by a, a, a doctor in a hospital. No. We do better than that. We do better than that. Okay. Amen. Hallelujah. And our goal is for our members to become healthier as time goes by. Healthier, I said. Today, you may have arthritis. Tomorrow, that arthritis will be totally gone from you like it happened to me. You may have migraine headache today, and a few days later, or a couple of weeks, the migraine will be totally gone like it happened to me. You may have chronic back pain, and then a few days or a few weeks from now, that will be gone as well, like it happened to me. You may have cancer, okay, and then we're going to put that cancer to run from you, okay, through the power of the Holy Spirit and in the, the name of Jesus, and that cancer is going to leave your body in, in perhaps in a few days from now, or perhaps a couple of weeks, just like it happened to me. Okay? That's why we minister spiritual surgery. It's done in the spiritual realm, in the power of the Holy Spirit. You don't have to go pay a visit to a doctor. You don't have to go to the hospital. Everything is done right there in your home. I don't have to be under your roof because the Holy Spirit is there. Okay? Now, in order for you to be healed, in order for you to grow healthier as time goes by, your heart, your spiritual heart must be clean. Your spiritual heart must be clean. Clean from what, Brother Carlos? Bitterness, resentment, unforgiveness, hatred, hate, gossip. Are you listening to the Holy Spirit? Do you want to be totally healed of your infirmities? Do you want to live a healthy life? Then your spiritual heart must be clean. Now, this is what I want you to do. If you can join me here every day, great. If you can watch this on demand, great. Because this video is being recorded and is going to be available 24-7. You can watch this on demand. Okay, I recommend that two members, I said members, you must become a member to benefit from this. I'm not doing this for everybody under the sun. I'm doing this for our members, for our family members. Okay, for the family members of our members. Okay, amen. Praise God. People need to show commitment in order to be blessed. So, yeah, my commitment is to do this every day, okay, live. Now, keep in mind, there will be days that I won't be here because I'll be traveling or I'll be elsewhere. But, you know, for the most part, I'll be here. Now, if I am not here, okay, then don't worry, okay? The Holy Spirit knows who you are and he knows what you need. 
And then when I come back again to the broadcast, then we'll do it. We'll, kept, we'll keep the ball rolling. Right? Praise God. Hallelujah. Now keep in mind that we put Dimas to run every day, and that is offline too, every day. Okay? I don't mind, you know, also putting your cancer to run every day, off, you know, offline. It doesn't hurt me. I can do it. Praise God. But there's more power if you are here listening to this. More power to you, more power to your family. Okay? Now, in order to clean your heart, in order to prepare the way for you to be totally healed, and if you want family members to be healed as well, you must relay this to them. You must relay this to them. They need to have their hearts clean. Okay? Amen? Now, Every day, I'm going to encourage you to do this at least once a day. If you can do it several times a day, it's even better. What is it? Repeat after me. You must do this at least once a day. Repeat after me. Say, Father in heaven, I forgive everyone that ever hurt me one way or another. I forgive them. I love them. I bless them, and I pray for them. Now, Father in heaven, forgive me of all my sins and trespasses, as I have forgiven those who have trespassed against me. Thank you, Father, for forgiving me. In Jesus' mighty name. What is that that we just did here? Okay, this is how you clean your spiritual heart. Okay, by forgiving. Forgiving those who have trespassed against you. We don't send a curse back to the sender. That is witchcraft. We never send a curse back to the sender. You never saw Jesus doing that. You never saw Paul the Apostle doing that. We never send a curse back to the sender. That is witchcraft. If you have done it, you have practiced witchcraft. And therefore, you must ask God to forgive you. Never do that again. When people curse you, you love them. When they persecute you, you bless them. Right? When they hurt you, you forgive them. Right? That's how we do it. Okay, now if I were you, I will read Matthew 5.44. Matthew 5.44. Love your enemies. Pray for those who persecute you and bless those who curse you. That's Matthew 5.44. How about Mark 11.25-26? When you stand praying, forgive those who have trespassed against you so that your Father in heaven may also forgive you. But if you do not forgive those who have trespassed against you, neither your Father will forgive you. We must forgive everyone that ever hurt us. That's how you put cancer to run. That's how you get rid of diabetes. That's how you get rid of arthritis. That's how you get rid of migraine headache. Now, you can always cast out migraine headache, which is a demon anyway. Amen. That's why we do this, right? We put Dimas to run. Amen. But here we are doing a spiritual surgery. Amen. With the help of the Holy Spirit. He's the one removing the sickness and disease from our bodies. Praise God. Again, if you want family members to benefit from this, you need to sign up so then they can be included. And then you ask them to come here too. Or, you know, or watch this video. This video is going to be available. All right. Let's minister now with spiritual surgery, okay? I want you to sit down in, in a very comfortable position. Or you can lie down on your couch or on the floor or on your bed. Okay? Lie down there. I want you to feel very comfortable right now. Even if you fall asleep, that's okay. Amen? That's how we're going to minister right now spiritual surgery praise god <clears throat> listen i don't have to know what you have because god knows what you have okay god knows your health issues right 
Okay, amen. I'm going to name some of it here. If I don't name yours, don't worry. The Holy Spirit knows what you need. Amen. That's the beauty of having the Holy Spirit as our physician. Amen. He is our doctor. Amen. He knows everything about your body. All we're going to do right now is be in his presence and he's going to perform surgery in our bodies. Amen. Then relax, feel comfortable. Let's start. You can also say what I'm going to say or, or something similar. Or you don't have to say anything. Just close your eyes and listen. Father, we just praise you. Father, we just magnify you. Thank you, Father, for the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. For the Holy Spirit. <clears throat> we now, Father, invite the Holy Spirit to come. And to enter our bodies. And to remove sickness, disease, infirmity from us. Oh, Holy Spirit. Thank you for ministering to us. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for removing cancer from our members. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for removing our trials. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for removing pain, chronic pain, fibromyalgia, migraine headache. We praise you. We lift your name on high. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for touching us right now. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for touching our family members, our descendants. We also include them here, Holy Spirit. Thank you for being our physician. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for being our doctor. Oh, hallelujah, we praise you, Father. We praise you, Lord Jesus Christ, our Savior. Thank you for your healing power, Lord Jesus. Thank you for your mighty power, Lord Jesus. Thank you for the power that is in your name, Lord Jesus. We praise you. We glorify you. We lift your name on high. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Spirit, now for removing our sickness and diseases, pain. Thank you for making us healthier. Thank you for helping us to forgive and to love those who curse us, those who hate us. We bless them, we love them, we forgive them. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for your mighty power. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for the work that you are performing in us right now. Have your way, Holy Spirit. Have your way, Holy Spirit. We invite you into our hearts. We invite you, Holy Spirit, into our bodies. We thank you for your healing power. We thank you, Holy Spirit, for performing surgeries inside our bodies. We thank you. We praise you. We lift your name on high. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Father, we praise you. Thank you, Father, we praise you. Thank you, Father, for touching our bodies right now. Thank you, Father, for removing everything that Satan has brought upon us. Thank you, Father, for healing us. Thank you, Father, for your mighty power. Thank you for performing this surgery in us. Thank you for removing 
all sickness, all diseases, all infirmity, all pain. Thank you for removing mental illness. Thank you for removing sanity, depression, anxiety. Thank you, Father, for making us whole. We praise you. We praise you. We praise you. Now the Holy Spirit is touching you. Members, our members, the Holy Spirit is touching you. And He is also touching your immediate family members. Say thank you, Father, for healing me. Thank you, Father, for setting me free. Thank you, Father, for loving me. In Jesus' mighty name I pray. Amen. Say amen. All right, friends, those of you who are not members, okay, I'm going to encourage you to become a member. You have so much to gain, and all you have to lose is demons, curses, and witchcraft, sickness, disease, and infirmity. That's it. Amen. You and your family deserve what we offer here through the power of the Holy Spirit, through the power of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. You and your family deserve. How can you sign up? Go to brothercarlos.com. Amen. There you look for Spiritual Warfare Strategic Network. We have two videos there side by side. Watch them. Learn about what we can do. Then sign up. It's painless. It's easy. All you have to do is go to brothercarlos.com. That's the website. The link is also below this video on YouTube. BrotherCarlos.com Let's pray the final prayer right now. Father, I ask right now that you seal this deliverance and that you fill every empty spot vacated by unclean spirits with the presence of the Holy Spirit in all of us here and also in our loved ones. Yevareha Adonai Veishmereha Yaer Adonai Panaveleha Vihuneka Isa Adonai Panaveleha Veyasem Leha Shalom the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord makes his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance towards you and give you peace. God bless you now. Have a good day and come back tomorrow for more. Amen. God bless you now. Have a good day. Bye now.